Hi guys, welcome to my video, and this is what candles are burning in my house. This is the first video of this little series. I'm thinking I'm gonna be doing this probably about, I don't know, once a season, because um, normally I have themed candles in my house for the season. So, first I'm gonna start off by telling you guys what candles I was burning in my house over the Christmas season because um, they're about to get put away and I have some new candles that I've already started burning. So, first off, I have two of the same candle. I had one in my family room right here and one, I had one in the bedroom and one in the living room and this, and this candle was in the dining room. All right, so I'm gonna do a review of those candles, if I like the smell, if I would repurchase, if I'm gonna save them or just throw them away. So these, I believe, we purchased at Target. They're the Ashlyn brand, um, and it is the Christmas tree. We smelled a lot of candles to find these. Hidden gems, they smell exactly the Christmas tree. They still have their scent, even though they've been burned most of the way. That's one of my biggest pet peeves when candles lose their scent after you've burned them for a while. Um, but they definitely still have their scent, and I really, really, really like these candles. They smell just like a Christmas tree. They were great to have during the holiday season to have around. Um, then this big candle that has been butchered it is a colonial candle. It's called Holly and Ivy. Um, it was a big one. And it still has its smell as well. Um, I actually, the wicks burned out and I've been putting this, I put this on my warmer. Um, the reason it's all like this is because Alex took his knife to it when the um, wicks started burning faster than the wax. And he doesn't really care what candles look like. So hence all the wax on the back. But um, it even smelled up a room when I put it on my burner. So what I think I'm gonna do is maybe one day this week, I will burn the whole thing and pour it into my burner and um, then freeze my burner and save the disc as like a Christmas disc because this is just way too big to haul around. So that's normally what I do to um, put extra wax that I really enjoy into a Scentsy. I make my own Scentsy kind of um, and it seems to work out fairly nicely. All right, so now I'm gonna go into candles that I am burning now. Now, since all the holiday seasons are kind of gone, there's no more like fall scents, there's no um, Christmas scents, which are my favorite themed scents. I normally always, I normally always, I normally now just kind of stick to more of aromatherapy scents. Um, sometimes in the summer I'll get like a coconut candle or something, um, but I don't really have any of those right now. I bought all these candles that I'm gonna show you at TJ Maxx. I think TJ Maxx has some of the best deals on candles. Um, they have everything on clearance. They have Yankee candles for like $12. Um, and yeah, so let's get started. So, I bought two of these. These are the Peck Schniffs England candles. They look like this, sorry, I was burning this one. And this one is belongs in my bathroom. I put this one in my bathroom. As I've told you guys before, I like to put more refreshing candles in the bathroom. This scent is ginger flower and patch chole, souffle, patch souffle. Um, it smells really, really good and really fresh. I like it. I like clean, simple, fresh scents in my bathroom. I don't like, I don't really put seasonal candles in my bathroom. I don't put, I don't even know. I just normally pick always clean scents to put in my bathroom. Clean cotton is one of those that I always put in there. Um, so this candle is definitely my bathroom candle and I've already burnt it about three times. So it's 10.9 ounces in case you're interested. Second, Peck Sniffs candle that I bought was this lavender and white tea candle. I haven't burned it yet, um, but I really like to get lavender candles for the bedroom 
because they make you sleepy. And I normally burn it. I start burning it around six o'clock and I let it kind of burn until about nine. And then I blow it out and the scent kind of stays in the room while I fall asleep. I've been getting really into like things like teas and smells and things like aromatherapy. There we go, aromatherapy. I've been really into that lately because um, I've just been trying to surround myself with positive feelings. I'm sounding really weird now. Okay, back to the candle. So I haven't burned this one yet, but it smells, it kind of reminds me of what my mom, a perfume my mom used to wear when I was little. Um, and I really enjoy it. I think I'm excited to burn it is basically what I'm telling you. This candle I bought for cuteness points. I didn't necessarily buy it because it's cool brand or anything. Um, it doesn't even tell me what brand it is. Okay, it says this is a DW Home Candle. I really liked it because it had the chalkboard thing on the front and it was in a mason jar and I thought that was super cute. And it smells like white gardenias. This is our kitchen candle. Um, Alex doesn't per se like this candle very much. He made a comment that he didn't like the smell. But I really like it. It's another one of those like clean smells but it's not super clean for the kitchen. It's like flowers. Flowers are blossoming. Um, and it's really cute, it comes with its own little chalk. I drew a little heart on it, but it's kind of getting smeared because I've been touching it for this video. But um, I burned about three times and it's still pretty full, so I really like that. It doesn't just burn straight through. That's one thing I don't like about soy candles is they just burn, like it's gone within an hour. So I definitely think this is cuteness points. I'll be keeping this jar after my candle is done, just again for, pure cuteness points and I like it. I like it a lot. Now the last candle that I'm going to show you is a Yankee candle and it's an herbal, it says, okay, it says a bunch of things in like all different directions on the front. So it says herbal, soothing, calming, comfort, bright, relaxing, clean, classic, spa, aromatic, fragranced candle. And this scent is Reflexing Lavender. Now this is the lavender candle that is in my bedroom right now and I love it. It smells up the entire house. I absolutely love this candle. It burns nice, you can see it has a nice clean burn on it. Um, and it's very scented, you can kind of, it has like a lavender and a vanilla scent at the same time, which is two of my favorite scents in the entire world. And it's purple to look like lavender and it makes me sleepy and I love it. So that's all for my candles right now. If you guys liked this video, this was just kind of me picking a random themed video. I like candles. I like to watch videos on candles. Some people are crazy collectors. I just consider myself a mild, crazy candle fanatic. Um, and yes, please like this. Leave me comments telling me um, if you guys like this, if you didn't like this video. And I will see you guys next for a big announcement. So stay tuned and watch the next video.